Hello YouTube, my name is Jagger Wolf and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we'll be having an overview of the Chevrolet Corvette Z06. If you guys do enjoy the series, make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel with the bell notifications on so you won't miss any automotive content daily. Anyways, without further ado, let's get started. With the 2007 Chevrolet Corvette Z06, the name of the game is Acceleration. The car is blindly fast. When you stop the accelerator, the world gets blurry. The Z06 has been clocked at 3.5 seconds from 0 to 60, which is supercar territory. Driving on public roads, this acceleration means you can pull in between fast moving traffic or pass on two lane highways with little worry. The hood dips down gracefully in front, while the back flares up like a Le Mans racer from the late 1960s, and it's proved an excellent car for the more recent Le Mans races taking multiple first place wins in the GT1 class over the past five years. Surprisingly enough, the Corvette Z06 is also a good tech car. The doors use electronic hatches. It has a smart key and option with navigation system. Bluetooth phone integration isn't available, but OnStar, which has telephone service, is optional. It comes standard with a heads up display, which could be really useful. And there's also performance tech such as carbon fiber fenders, a dry sump oil system, and a limited slip differential. The most noticeable performance element of the Corvette Z06 is the massive 7 liter 505 horsepower LS7 V8 with 470 pound feet of torque at 4,800 RPM. The naturally aspirated LS7 engine pushes the Corvette from 0 to 60 in just 3.5 seconds. Measures taken to lighten the car become apparent when you first open the doors. They move easily without any heaviness. Carbon fiber front fenders and cabin floor helps the Z06 shed about 50 pounds from the standard Corvette's 3,217 pound curb weight. Given the Corvette Z06 performance, one of its most useful tech features is the heads-up display. This display projects the car's speed and a graphic of an analog tachometer on the front windshield. The display's position is adjustable, so you can put it close to your forward line of sight or keep it closer to the hood. It has a number of different modes that show additional information, such as oil temperature and lateral g-forces. The six-speed manual transmission has good gear ratios. With its high horsepower, the engine doesn't have a problem moving the car at 1500 RPM in 5th gear. This feature is designed to avoid the gas guzzler attacks, as it sort of games the EPA testing. You can also defeat it by running the RPMs up between shifts. While driving, there is plenty of noise from the engine, the tires, and the body panels, which rattle a bit. Although by some standards the cabin is luxuriously appointed, Chevrolet opt to keep the weight down by not surrounding the car with sound damping materials. Presets are shown in the big buttons on the screen with 6 presets per page. The head unit connects to a 7 speaker Bose audio system which has 2 speakers on each door, 2 speakers in the cargo area, behind the seats, and a subwoofer. But anyway guys, I do hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you leave a like and subscribe to join the Wolf Pack. If you are new to the channel, turn the bell notifications on so you won't miss any automotive content daily. Let me know your thoughts on the Chevrolet Corvette Z06. But anyway guys, that is all for today and thanks for watching. Peace, Wolf Pack. Design the brass will count is that the rhyme designed to fill your mind Now that you realize that the prize arrived You got to pump the stuff to make us tough From the hardest to start a work of art to revolutionize Make a change, nothing strange People, people, we all the same No, we're not the same Cause we don't know the game What we need is a win